So we're always asked questions. Uh, I had a guy by the name of Zach ask me a question today regarding silverfish. Something that we don't come across a lot. Um, as weird as it is, we just don't get calls for silverfish. But one thing leads back to everything I always say is a dehumidifier will help. If that doesn't help, obviously you could call us. We also sell dehumidifiers, whole house dehumidifiers. One thing we do get a lot of calls on is fruit flies. People think that we could come in and just spray the air to get rid of fruit flies. Fruit flies come from a source. That source could be a rotting bag of potatoes in your closet that you forgot were there. They could be the fresh fruit that you just brought from the grocery store. That fruit sits in a grocery store, and trust me, grocery stores have fruit flies. They're laying their eggs on that fruit. You now bring it into your house and put it right in the middle of your kitchen table, and you've now introduced fruit flies to your home. One thing to do is when you get back from the grocery store, wash your fruit immediately before you put it on the table or put it in the crisper in your refrigerator. If you do see fruit flies, you have a garbage disposal. When that garbage disposal turns on, it throws that food upwards. Take your hand and go underneath the drain and wipe clean all that residue that's tossed up in your kitchen sink. Another thing you could do is rinse out your trash receptacle. Your kids may throw in fruit juice, a drink, and that can liner doesn't hold that liquid and it leaks into the bottom of your garbage can. That's a prime area for a breeding site for fruit flies. I hope that answers your question, Zach, about silverfish. And Sue, I hope that answers your question about fruit flies. We'll see you in the next video. Oh, oh, oh.